Good afternoon, guys, and thanks for joining me this afternoon. So, Islamic, so and some Islamic clerics have come out to tell Tinubu that no man born of a woman can stop them from protesting. That in short, the window for apology or doing the right thing has been short. That the protest must take place. You know, Tinubu decided to start sharing rice to states because he have heard that people want to protest. He thought it's like before, where they would just do this kind of um, outside dressing when the inside is bad, just outside dressing to deceive people. You're sharing rice. People say they want to be able to buy rice cheap, not free rice. When the free rice finish, in short, how many cups of rice can eat people get from what you're sharing? Five trucks of rice to eat it. Do you know how many? Do you know how many people? Do you know the millions of people that reside in East it? So what can five trucks of rice do for them? Because people have heard that people want to protest, and when I don't hear say more not that as they carry on very seriously, people are now you know wanting to play hanky panky, paying clerics to say protest is haram and all of this. But they have a message, a very strong message for Tinubu. They say the protest is going to go on, that. The only thing they will tell their people is don't destroy people's property, don't steal people's stuffs. We are coming out to air our grievances. So nothing can stop it. No apology, no imam, no. They said nothing can stop it this time around. It's a must. People are coming out. Well, we show you the video. Uh, it was said in Hausa, but what I just said now is the summary of what the man was trying to say. But before I do that, let me quickly show you this video of former presidential uh, aspirant, a candidate of the ZLP party, uh, Dan uh, Wanyangu, accusing Nelson Wiki of trying to assassinate him because he came out in defense of Fubara. Listen to him and we'll come back, we'll continue. Delaying you. Since our last interaction here, uh, some unknown persons have been following me with vehicles and I've been monitoring. But the thing came to a head on Friday when I was physically confronted. So this is a threat to the life of Chief Dan Wanyang, my humble self. I am constrained to bring to the notice of the Nigerian public the unprovoked threat to my life by a notorious agent of the former governor of River State and now Minister of Federal Capital Territory, Chief Nelson Wike, by name, Mr. Moses Emmanuel. This bloodthirsty killer brazenly confronted me at the pastry shop Transcorp Hilton where I was having snacks and coffee with my friend Alaji Aliu. He said he wanted to, when he came he said he wanted to speak with me. Not having known him before, I demanded to know what he wanted to speak to me about. He insisted he would like to speak with me, and I offered him a seat to sit down. He introduced himself as a brother to Chief Nelson Wike and began a threat to my life, making reference to the television interview I granted where I expressed my personal views on the avoidable crisis in River State, which was being orchestrated and fueled by the followers of the former governor by his instinct against the incumbent governor, Chief Simi Fubara. All right, welcome back, guys. I guess you heard it. Omo, hey, <laughs> now, wow. Nigeria. 
Some people have just taken Nigeria to be their own. It just did like say Nigeria did their pocket. So they can just rise up and want to do anything. You heard it from his mouth, not from me. And if it's true, then it is really a bad one. Because people should be allowed to hear their views. People should be allowed to hear their views. Threat of assassination and all of that. I'm happy he came out to say it so that Nigerians we know. Now, having said that, let me show you what uh, this, uh, I think this is also an imam, I think. I think so. But listen to what he said about the upcoming protests. And I will come back. We'll wrap up. Please watch. Ah, you go to Borini. To Kariani. Nache Kariani. Embaka some constitution, but Mumon says you don't want to see. Bakwa can the constitution, Kuruza Kurunga Putua. She has a much about the other Kachima and Mashawara. Who could I was the Akasa de Bas Arab Muslim Chita Kavi, but to Kudinka currently lit top in the Ake Indo Kadashi Akasa. Constitution and Nigeria, she bought a damai and Kazanga. Why would you look at Kiran Kazanga Zamiwa? She about in Nigeria, that my put away is in Kazanga in Beja Diva. So, in the constitution, they were the damas, it's a mobile, but whatever they were put over and no pushing can you. Hakasuma, assassin, Hakasashi, Yah, then Nigeria, Ambashi, Dama, put away no pushing, I look at in Dakama Badi Diva. A matter hundred the Tadachi, Hakakapala. Kumaka, but I knew in that. Mutunze put away no pushing. Never go. Kerja tu kan? Iban kaya muda ni. Kerja tu orang kaya guna tu. Mungkin kaya guna tu. Bana tu nego bana. Bana minus tuh cipane. Bana guna ni bana. Kaya yang guna tu kaya muni. Bukan muda tu kaya guna tu. Dua one day tu kaya guna tu. Baca ini jangan jangan gaya cipu orang ni dah. One day pas kaya yang siapa guna muda ni. Baca ini jangan jangan gaya cipu orang ni dah. Kuma mungkin gaya cipu muda ni makan nasi dekamu. Yang kuma jangan jangan rosak aku sana muda ni kamu sesi. Ama, kamu lihat dia kaya dah jangan jangan gaya kaya dia. Zau ku ia cerai cici ku bulu cincu hana kau mesti piawa naya ya halat. Kaya dah jangan jangan gaya. I end the ticket at constitution. Then you block in Kenya. Ba one day she go one day puta. Who does who must say, I can't want to look at what you can't see. Tentini, the lacas and the attic. No one can go catch away. I knew what I am. I doubt what I am. Who is the Muda? Telaka and whatever you ask me, you can't reach in the wind. Who can I put in the Lakata when China? Well, I have you as a Mikita. Someone that got couldn't I junk a Makanat and a young Kadesi and a winching. Can I the Nera do go to wash and I junk a Kadesi and a winching and Lata Kari and the Wako Sisi? Someone that goes to the Kona. Ama susun aja susun apa aja kak. So ada kak. Kuma tasa. Band di bank kain jema a band yang pernah de kain musi de kain gomnet. So mungkin kain gomnet itu nak kawan ni. Band yang pernah de kain gomnet. Muka kerja tu dah selipas. Kau ada tak kelimi macam orang garia. So ada kak kuma nak terbuat terumbu kerja cewa. Zangga zangga Nigeria kau main dengan apa dah? Kau main dengan konstitusi dengan Nigeria. Shua kau main dengan Nigeria. Ba one day terpahana tak? So ada kak halat terciak. Kuma bezamu boleh wa. Ida mu ayamu boleh. 
tunda ita ce hanya kwade kwaya da yake lo wacce shugabanni suke iya sauraron talaka to lalle in ma haramun ce to dole fatawa za ta canza to ma ai bubun ba zama jahile ba malamin da zai mana kwana da kai qur'ani kake bude ga karanta bude kana karanta muna ganin bakin hadi sai ne kana bude wa kana karantawa in sharhi za ka yi ka bude sharhi kana karanta muna ganin ba zama jidadawa ba kar mu ce kallon ku saboda haka fatawa na canzawa a lokacin da wani abu ya faru mu kun san haka domin Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala cikin alqur'ani ya ce hurrimat alaykumul baytata wa dam wa lahamul kinzir ko wa dama wa lahamul kinzir wa ma uhilla li ghayri allah bi ko wa ma uhilla bihi li ghayri allah Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala ya ce ya haramta cin mushi da jini da naman alade da abin da aka yanka dan wannan Allah ba dan Allah ba da abin da boka yanka kenan Allah ya ce duka ya haramta wannan amma karshen ayar mai Allah ya ce fa man yurra ghayra bagin wala adim fala ithma alai kaga fatawa ta canza kenan fatawa farko ayar Allah ya ce ya haramta mushe da jini da abin da aka da alade amma sai Allah ya ce ga wanda yake a takore ga wanda yake a matse ga wanda ya je dokar daji ba gida ga ba gida ba yin wata ka je shi Allah ya ce ya ci abinci ya ci mushe in ya gani ya ci naman alade an yadda ya ci abin da aka yanka dan boka ya yanka dan aljanni an yadda fatawa ba ta canza ba to saboda haka tunda a Najeriya masu mulki ba sa jin tsoron Allah ba sa jin wa'azi ba sa jin kalan Allahu kalan rasul to ashe kenan dole fatawa ta canza amma ba san ga zanga haramun fatawa za ta canza yin ta ya zama wajibi ya zama dole wanda bai kuma ya aikata laifi saboda haka mu ba gida da wani kar take in ma haramun ce wannan din zanga zanga din to a a aya qur'ani kai tsaye fatawa tana iya canza zanga zangan ta koma halas dama ni ba yau na tafi fadan wannan ba na sha fada tuntuni na ce dama tuntuni zanga zanga ta dade da halatta a najeriya ba wai yanzu ba balanta na yanzu ai yanzu ya halatta wallahi shin yin kadan ma ta zama duk wanda ya je la dago wanda bai je ba sai ya yi zinubi shin yin kadan kere ziya rage sai mun fara tukunna za mu gani mu gani in mutun ya je la da no ya kamata kowa ya samu mu ce muna raba la dan ba amma wallahi in dai mutun ya je da ke kyawun ni akwai la da mun ce akwai la da in kai zaka fito ka ce ba la da mu zo mu yi kace kace da kai ayoyin da ka gada hadisan mu zo ka yi mana bayani inda ta zama haramu saboda haka wannan shine magana ta gaskiya zanga zanga ya halatta halas ne dole ne a fito dan mu kwaci yancin mu dan mai maganin zalunci da azalumai da dokoki da suke kawo da rashin mutunci dole ne mu fito mu kare wannan da wannan muke addu'a Allah ya zaunar da kasan mu lafiya Allah ya zaunar da kasan mu lafiya duk wanda ke neman kawo tashin tashi na a wannan kasar da yake neman takura talakawa har su fito su yi rigima ya Allah kai maganin sa da wannan nake cewa wassalamu alaikum warahmatullahi ta'ala wabarakatuh All right, welcome back guys. I guess you heard him. Now, like I said, he said the door for apology, the door for deceit with, you know, palliatives, with rice and all of that is shut. No matter what you do between now and the time for protest, the protest must take place. And he said no Islamic cleric will confuse them. He said no. have made up their mind if you like go and pay them any amount they have made up their mind they are hitting the streets the hunger is too much man it's too much we are going through a whole lot and it's not just in one part of the of nigeria it is everywhere from the southeast to the southwest to the northwest to the northeast to the north central to the south south everywhere people are experiencing hardship like never before an old man said he has stayed he have seen how many governments and this is the worst that he has, they have never gotten it this bad before and then you feel a few trucks of rice to give to people maybe one one mudu these people don't even they know rate us at all truly they know rate us at all you don't go buy new presidential jet 150 billion even when people were clamoring that no you shouldn't you don't buy it because you don't care you feel Nigerians can't do anything and now people are saying the door is shut for apology no imam I never seen northern as this serious let's see what will happen in the coming days i said let me show you this video thanks for watching and god bless you